I tried to upload a video last night on the comments Kevin Ward Jr.'s family made. And for some reason it failed. I don't know if YouTube has put a block on them videos or what. But this is going to be about Tony Stewart deciding not to race at Michigan. Jeff Burton is a good choice to fill in for Tony Stewart. Jeff Burton's a great driver to begin with. Well respected in the garage area, known as the mayor of the garage area. Veteran driver has about, <coughs> excuse me, has about 20 cup wins, I think. I'm not sure if he's won at Michigan, but for a couple other reasons, at least one for sure. He spent several years at Richard Childress Racing. If any team knows how to bounce back from a tragedy, it was Richard Childress Racing in 2001. And on that deal, Kevin Harvick, now with Stuart Haas Racing, who spent what, 13 years with Richard Childress Racing in Cup should definitely be able to help bounce back from tragedy. If you remember, after the tragic death of Dale Earnhardt in, 2000, in the 2001 Daytona 500, Kevin Harvick took over the car. They went through a timeline. Let's get them comfortable at the next race, Rockingham. Then they went to the next race. I forget where it was and finished okay. Then they went to the third race after Daytona at Atlanta and won in a thrilling finish with Jeff Gordon. But Jeff Burton's a good choice. That's all there is to it. That's just my opinion. I know that Regan Smith was discussed, but with the Nationwide Series at Mid-Ohio and the logistics and Regan Smith running for a championship, now the trucks are at Michigan this week, so that would have been a possibility. Somebody from the trucks, I would like to seen somebody like Ron Hornaday if they couldn't get Jeff Burton jump in the car see what he could do but yeah pure and simple Jeff Burton's a good choice to fill in disclaimer strictly my opinion 